Hey kids today let's learn how to read time Rise and shine it's time to wake up what time do you wake up in the morning at 6 o'clock Time to wake up What time do you go to school? At 8 o'clock. Mm. Let me ask you a question. You do lots of activities in a day. But how do you know that it's time to start the activities? How do I find out? We use clocks. We use clocks to know what time of the day it is. Okay. Clocks are everywhere. In your house, in the buildings, and in your phone. Do you know that your watch is also a clock? There are two types of clocks. Analog clocks and digital clocks. Clocks are devices used to measure time indicating hours, minutes, and seconds. Do you know how long are hours, minutes and seconds? Second is the shortest. 60 seconds make 1 minute. 60 seconds make 1 minute. 60 minutes make 1 hour. 60 minutes make 1 hour. 24 hours make 1 day. 24 hours make 1 day. 1 day can be divided into two equal halves of 12 hours each. We use AM to tell time in the first half of the day. We use PM to tell time in the second half of the day. Let's look at the parts of an analog clock. The main parts of a clock are the face and hands. The clock has a short hand called hour hand. The clock has a long hand which is called minute hand. And some models of clocks has a thin second hand also called a sweep hand. The face is the part of the clock that displays the numbers and the hands. The face of the clock is numbered from 1 to 12. These are the hours in a clock. There are 60 lines or dots evenly spaced in a ring around the face of the clock showing minutes and seconds. The hands are fixed at the center of the face. The hands point to the current time of the day by showing the hours, minutes and sometimes the seconds. All the three hands of a clock continuously rotate in the direction of increasing numbers. This is called clockwise direction. For now, let's just focus only on the hour hand. The short hand is the hour hand. The hour hand shows the current hour of the day. The hour hand reads the hour by pointing at numbers from 1 to 12. Hour hand is the slowest. In a day, the hour hand moves around the clock only twice. Okay, now let's read the hour hand. What hour is it? What number is the hour hand pointing to? 8 Yes, the hour is 8. What number is the hour hand pointing to? 10. Yes. What hour is it? 12. Yes, 12. Now, let's look at the minute hand. Minute hand reads the minutes in the clock. Minute hand reads the numbers from 0 to 60. Minute hand shows how many minutes has gone by. 
minute hand takes 60 minutes that is one hour to go around the clock the minute hand is faster than the hour hand when the minute hand points at 12 we say o'clock o'clock When the minute hand points at 1, we say 5 minutes passed, as it has moved from 0 to 5. 5 minutes passed. When the minute hand moves to the number 2, we skip count by 5 and say 10 minutes passed. 10 minutes passed. When the minute hand points to 3, we say 15 minutes passed. 10 plus 5 makes 15 or 3 times 5 makes 15. 10 minutes passed. When the hand points at 4, we say 20 minutes passed. 20 minutes passed. And so on. When the hand is at 5, we say 25 minutes passed. 25? 30? When the hand is at 6, we say 30 minutes. We skip count by 5 every time the minute hand moves to the next point. 35? Now, look closely. Can you read the minute hand? The minute hand is 3 points from 35. So, 35 plus 3 is 38 minutes past. 38 Let's read it one more time. When minute hand points to 3, we say 15 minutes past or a quarter past. When the minute hand points at 6, we say 30 minutes past or half past. When minute hand points to 9, we say 45 minutes past or a quarter to. Let's read some clocks. What time is it? Where does the long minute hand points to? 12 12 So, it is o'clock Where does the short hour hand points to? 3 3 So, the time is 3 o'clock 3 o'clock What time is it? Where does the long minute hand points to? That is o'clock. Shorthand points to six. Six. That means the time is six o'clock. Six o'clock. What time is it? The long hand says o'clock. The short hand says ten. The time is ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. What time is it? 2 o'clock. Yes, 2 o'clock. What time is it? 5 o'clock. 5 o'clock. What time is it? 12 o'clock. Yes, when both the hour hand and the minute hands are on number 12, it is 12 o'clock. Now comes the trickier part. The long hand is at 2, that is 10 minutes past. The short hand is at 3. What time is it? Time is 3.10 or 10 minutes past 3. Long hand is at 4, that is 20 minutes past. 20 minutes past. Short hand is at 6, so the time is 6 
20 or 20 minutes past 6 long hand is at 45 minutes short hand is at 2 so the time is 2.45 or 45 minutes past 2 <laughs> please subscribe thank you for watching Bye bye. To learn about time, watch our video titled Concept of Time. The link is in the description. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.